Hi, Evelyn. Nice to see you. How are you? Everything good? All good? Hello, was, good, night. Uh, good evening. How, how was your day today? Um, very good. Very good. All right. When you when you come to class, all right, when you're not saying goodbye, you have to say good evening, right? Good evening, not good night. Good night is like when you say goodbye, right? Good night, you know, I'm gonna sleep uh, okay. right now, right? That's when you say goodbye, okay? All right, excellent. Uh, okay. All right. Uh, uh, Catherine is invis invisible today. Hello, Catherine, invisible Catherine. She's there, but you can't see her, right? Uh, Stephanie, hello. hello, Stephanie, how are you? All good? Good night, teacher, I'm good, and you? All right, all good. Good evening, not good night. Good night is when you say goodbye, okay? Good uh, okay, good evening. All right, very good. Uh, Fernando, how are you, Fernando? Everything good? I'm fine, thank you. All right, all right. I'm, I'm fine, not I fight. I'm fine. I'm, I'm fine. Thank you, thank you, right? Okay. Laura, Laura Mauricio, how's everything today? Everything good, good, Laura? All right, very good, guys. So, um, so we have a very interesting topic today. Let's get started, okay? So, what you're gonna do, uh, Catherine? Welcome, Catherine. I hadn't seen you there. Oh yeah, yeah, you were, you were away from your, you were AFK, guys. Do you know what AFK means? It means away from keyboard, okay? So when you're not in front of the computer and you have left your computer turned on, you know, it, it, you are away from the keyboard. So you're not there, okay? You're, you're basically not doing anything. That, that's what AFK means, got it? All right, anyways, so, uh, so guys, let's get started. Okay. All right, so I have an exercise for you guys. Uh, so remember yesterday, do you remember what we were doing yesterday, guys? What is um, a possessive adjective, guys? Possible. <laughs> who, who can tell me what a possessive adjective is? Do you remember the magic word? Toxic. Toxic, all right, very good, okay, right? <laughs> So, an adjective, okay, a toxic adjective, guys. So, what is a toxic adjective, guys? Possession, right? Possession. Because, right? Because el toxico thinks that you are his possession, right? El piensa que vos su posesión, right? So, right. So, we're good. So, uh, what I want you to do, guys, is that you're going to complete these exercises with possessive adjectives. Got it? I'm going to send this to the WhatsApp group, and you're going to complete them in, in couples. Voy a enviar esa imagen a esa WhatsApp group y ustedes lo van a completar en pareja. ¿Got it? Yes. yes Pretty good, are. guys. Pretty good. Okay, right. So let me send it right now. Hold on. Hey, what happened to everybody else? Ya les vamos a jalar las orejas. Right, very good. Hold on. Okay, so that's the first one. And this is the second one. And there is a third one. All right, guys, so let's go. Okay, uh, I'm gonna divide you into groups right now, guys, and let's go. Let's go, guys.
right. All right, guys. So let's get. You are mute. You're, you're muted, Laura. Yes. Okay. Okay, la primera dijo, I don't know the time because I can feel my, my ¿verdad? Ok. My, segunda, what's the boy's name? Entonces serían... No Spanish. Ok. Is your name? Your name is Banks. No, his name. It's uh huh. He. No, it's mine. No, it's mine. It's mine. Yeah. What's the voice name? It's mine. Uh huh. Because his, his name. His name is Ben. Is yeah. he? He's a boy. Baby has got a cat. I'm sorry, what was that? Baby has got a cat. Oh, I'm sorry, I thought they it's were calling me. It's sad. <laughs> mm -hmm. The dog's very cool. And... What do you think? What do you think? His name. His or it? Mm. I think that is. It's because it's about a cat. Um, uh, no, the number four. I'm um, sorry. Uh -huh. Um the yes. The number four, uh, I think, is uh his. His name yes. is Ben. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. Yeah, number, um, five. Okay. number five. All good, guys. Good. Yes. No. Yes. All right.
I don't know. I think it is, 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 I don't know what's true. Sundali, the children see them. Eat, eat. La ultima. Eat, eat. Tortoise. Excuse me? Tortoise es, es tortuga. Ok. Y la, y la, este, 15. It's there. It's there. Grandfather. So, so the children. ¿Qué significa esa frase? Lo que dice, ¿qué dice? De repente los niños vieron a un hombre mayor o un anciano. Uh -huh. Ese es su abuelo. Suddenly, the children see that open. It's their grandfather. I think yeah. they are. Okay. I finish. You finish them all? Yes. Right. Sorry, I, I was going to ask what happened to Catherine, but you're good. She's back here. Yes. Yo preguntar qué había pasado con Catherine, but I see that she's back here. Uh, All right. Yes. Uh, she has a problem with the internet. Internet. Mm -hmm. Okay. And number five. Mm -hmm. Five. Number five. Um, uh, that we are at school. Or uh, read the sentence. The sentence. Read the. the we are at school. Or the school is very nice. Yes, I is same. Yes. It's perfect. Next. Okay. I have a new laptop. It's mine. My laptop uh -huh. is white. It's mine. And you? I am from C Seattle. Yeah. Most, most of mm -hmm. our, fr our, our friends. Uh are from Seattle too. Mm -hmm. Rabbit is white. Its cage is in the garden. What's it's, meaning cage, it's, it's, teacher? Sandra teacher, what's and meaning Jenny? cage? Friends, they are yeah, there. Sandra and, and Jenny are friends. Hey. Hey, my hey. Your school is in the yes, city uh, center? No. Uh, Number nine. Uh, oh, I'm, I'm sorry, guys. I was muted. Hey. I'm muted. No. Perdón, uh, Jose, what were you asking me, Jose? ¿Qué me estás preguntando? What's meaning, uh, the number eight is a rabbit is white. Its cage is in the garden. What cage meaning is, cage? Cage is, cage is the thing that you use to put the rabbit inside. 
It's like this. The rabbit home. Not the home. Well, yeah. Yeah. Una jaula. Ah, uh -huh. okay. Right. okay. Thank you. Yes, no problem. Okay. Uh, Evelyn, the number nine, uh, Sandra and Janie are friends. Dale. Yours. Yours. School is in the city center. Ah, uh, yes. It's yours. It's yours. Um, yours or, yes. yours. or what? I think it's yours. Yes, because uh, I talked about the two person, no uh -huh. for me. Um, or, uh, That's correct. And the sentence is then the mother have a new car. Um, There. Your. 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 There. Yes, your. I think it is. Your car is blue. Yes, your car is blue. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Next. Number 11. Emma Peel has got a brother. Um, his name is Paul. No, it's her name. Her name. Evelyn, the, the 12. <laughs> Nikki back. Nikki Baker has a sister and the rabbit is how are you doing guys? Did you, did you, did you finish? Hey Miguel, welcome. Oh hello. Good evening. Good evening, sir. Did we finish? Uh, Nancy and me? No. I had a uh, question seven. We work and question eight the rabbit is white it's cage is it's in the cage garden is in the garden yes cage. cage cage do you know what a cage is what is cage what is a cage yeah what um, is a cage a cage is the place where you keep the rabbit el lugar donde oh, vos tenés el, el yeah. jaula right Okay, Sandra and Jenny are friends. They are. <laughs> Their school is in the city center. Is center or centre? Center. Center. Yes. The last question. What, what does center mean? Centro. And center, centro, and the word center, same thing, it means the same. Lo mismo significa, okay. right? Very good. It is. So, how are we doing, guys? Come on. I I, thought nice. we, I think we don't understand what uh, the sentence is. The last one, uh -huh, the last sentence. And the last sentence? Let's see. Suddenly, uh, suddenly the children see an old man. Yes, it easy, is. Easy peasy. I'm not going to give you the answer. It's easy. Think about it. It's a uh, grandfather. It, it says. Dice, de repente My. los niños vieron un hombre viejo. 
Que es su abuelo. Exactly. Es su abuelo. How do you say that? Es our grandfather. He's there. There. There, grandfather. Ah, there. Sí, ok. Sí, 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 sí. Ok. There, there grandfather. Oh. All right, good job. Okay. All right. Ok, so let's go back, guys. All right. Let's see, guys. Okay. All right. Also, guys, let's let's see. Okay. All right. So, who wants to give me answer number one, or do you want to pick, guys? Se van a ofrecer ustedes, guys, o quieren que yo los aviente los leones? All right, Evelyn. Thank you, Evelyn. Go ahead. Number one. Okay. I don't know the time because I can find uh, my watch. Very good. I can't find my watch. Good job. Good job, Evelyn. All right. Great. Um, Nancy, let's go, Nancy. Number two. What's the boy's name? His name is Ben Scott. Okay. I'm going to help you with the pronunciation, okay? Repeat, okay. what's the boy's name? What's the boy's name? His name is Ben Scott. His name is Ben Scott. No, 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 no. Tiene que cerrar la boca cuando se name, una M. Name. His name is Ben Scott. His name is Ben Scott. Repeat, his name is. His name is. Do it like this. Okay, he his is. His name is. And then say. Nay, and then say miss. His okay. name is. His name is. Exactly, right? His name so, is. so say his name is Ben Scott. His name is Ben Scott. Exactly. Good job, right? Okay. All right. Uh, number three. Who wants to give me number three, guys? All right, me? let's go, Laura. All right, where is it me? What's the boy's name? Its name is Ben Scott. Its name, guys? Like this, its name? It. His name. Repeat his name. His name. His name, guys. Cierra la voz cuando digan name, okay? It's like this. Name. name. Tiene una M, guys. Tiene que pronunciar esta M, right? Name. Okay, name. Right? Name. His name is Ben Scott, okay? Now, no, but number three. Number three is different. Okay. Debbie has a got a cat. Has got a cat. Repeat, has got a cat. Has got a, has a, got a has, cat. Has got a cat. Has got a cat. Uh-huh. Uh, three. It's... It's... It, it's cat is very... What is lovely? It's cat? No, guys, it's not it's here. Porque estamos usando it's aquí. Uh, number, number three? Yes. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> it's right. her. It's, oh, it's her. her. Okay, her. The, okay. The baby oh, cat. Right. Guys, la posesión es el gato. Mm. Oh, de, de quién es her. La de Debbie. Entonces, Debbie. Say her. Okay, yes. De ella. Exactly. All right. Very good. Uh, thank you, Miguel. All right, Nancy, number four, man. Nancy? Nancy, you're muted. Muteada. Excuse me. The dog is very cute. Its name is Ben. Its name. Guys. Its name. Cierra la boca cuando diga la M, right? Okay. Name is. Repeat, guys. Guys, repitan eso un millón de veces. Name is. Repeat, name, name is. is. Okay? Como name ne is. Neymar, guys. Okay? Si pueden decir Neymar, es la misma cosa. Name is. Name. Si pueden decir Neymar, name, name is. is. Everybody, name is. 
Names. 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 Okay. All right. Very good. So let's repeat. The dog is very cute. Uh huh. What else? The dog is very cute. Its name is Ben. Its name is Ben. Okay. His name uh, is Ben. Okay. Good job. Number five. Um, Catherine. Number five. We are at school, and our school is very nice. Our school, our, okay, our. Our. Good job. All right, uh, next one. Uh, let's see, hey, Jose. I have a new I laptop. I have a new laptop. Uh, my laptop is white. Very good, my, right? Stephanie, number seven. I'm from Seattle. Most of uh, my friends are from Seattle too. Good job. All right. Who wants to give me number eight? Number eight, guys. The Hello, rabbit. Guys. Huh? Sorry. Like the fish. Okay. The rabbit is white. It's key. Yeah, it's okay, guys. What is the meaning of a cage? The place where it's the rabbit. Exactly, guys. Okay. All right. A cage is, is like this, guys. Oh, sorry. A cage is like this, right? right? It's a rabbit jail. Yes, exactly. <laughs> exactly. It's like a rabbit jail. Exactly. All right. Poor rabbit. Okay. Uh, number nine. Who wants to give me number nine? Number nine. Okay. And Sandra and Jenny are friends. And their, their school is in the city center. Beautiful. Because we're talking about they, guys, because we're talking about two people here, it's they, right? So they, there, right? Very good. Uh, number 10. Who wants to give me number 10? The, the no. Miller mm -hmm. have a new car. Their car is blue. There. Repeat, guys. There. There. Yeah. Okay. Their car is blue. Okay. Good job. And applause for everybody, guys. Applause, 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 guys. Well done. All right. Really good job. Okay. All right. Oh, we still have more. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah. All right. So, yeah. all right. Uh, who wants to give me number 11? Emma Bill has got a brother. His name is Paul. His name, very good. All right, number 12. Nick Baker has a sister. Her name is Debbie. Okay. His name is Debbie. His name, guys? Are you sure his name? Who are we talking no. about here? Are we talking about sister or Nick? Her. 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 Guys, okay. Her. Her name, okay, is Debbie. All right, number 13, guys. <laughs> Yes, we have a dog. Mm -hmm. Their dog is very old. Mm -hmm. There, guys, are you sure? There. Their. Their. Uh, our. 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 our, guys. Our. our. Yes, our. Okay, very good. Number 14. What's, the, what's number 14? The rice have got a tortoise. Okay. And their name is Trundle. There, guys. Guys, all right, hold, hold on, guys. Hold on, all right? No quiero que se confunda, all right? Voy a mutear la firulais un ratito, guys. Okay, hold on. All right, so, guys, no se confunda. Guys, analicen de quién estamos hablando, okay? ¿Qué es la posición de quién? Esto, guys, el, el, uh, el adjective that you're going to use here, el adjetivo que vas a usar aquí, guys, depende si, de quién es el dueño. Tenés que hablar del dueño, guys, del dueño del objeto. In this case, guys, in this case, okay, which one is the, which one is the owner? ¿Quién es el dueño de qué aquí, guys? Which one is the owner of what here? Ellos. Boys. The boys is the owner, right? Yes. yes. All right. Very good. Now, all right, so we determine, okay, this is el dueño, right? So this is the owner, all right? And this is the tortoise. This is the, this is the, uh, the, yeah. 
the belonging, it's... right? Okay, esta es la posición, right? Now, ¿de quién estamos hablando aquí? De ellos. De ellos. I'm talking about... The boys. No, 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 no. no. ¿De, quién es... ¿De qué vamos a hablar aquí? The... The no, the tortoise. The, the tortoise. the tortoise, okay? Estamos diciendo que el nombre es Trundle, okay? Mm -hmm. So, aquí hace referencia que estamos hablando de la tortuga, okay? So, what is the right answer here? It. It. It's. It's, right? Su nombre. Estamos hablando It's del nombre de la tortuga, okay? La Trundle. posición, entonces aquí, guys, quiero que vean, right? La posición aquí, guys, es el nombre, okay? De la tortuga, mm -hmm. right? La tortuga es el dueño, right? En este caso, este es el dueño. Y el nombre va a ser el belonging, right? Va a ser la posición, right? Got it? Yeah. Right? Very good. Number, uh, numbers 15, guys. What's, what's number 15? Who wants to give me number 15? Evelyn. Let's go, Evelyn. Uh, I told them that children see an old, an old man. It's, uh, it's our grandfather. Mm. Hold on. The children. <laughs> what pronoun, con qué pronoun lo podría sustituir, sustituir the children? They. They. They, they guys, okay? They, es plural, okay? So, what is the possessive adjective of they? There. 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 Okay, there, guys. Not mm -hmm. our, there, right? Está hablando de su abuelo, no de tu abuelo. Got it? Mm -hmm. Right? Got it, guys? Okay. All right, very good. All right, good job, guys. Good job. All right, guys. So from one to ten, guys, how much the uh, have you understood? ¿Cuánto han entendido, guys? De luna diez. Este tema de de possessive adjectives, ¿cómo le quedó? Like eight, a nine, eight, eight. Like a six. Eight. So we have six. We have eight. We have seven. All right, very good. Eight. So, so this eight. is this is not a ten, okay? It's todavía no un ten, right? Quiero ponerle un 10 así, guys, ¿ok? ¿Se acuerdan? Do you remember that? Yes. Okay, like that. All right. Only if you're 30, right? Solo tenés como 30, ya. Yeah. All right. So, okay. So, listen, guys. If it is a 6 or 7, what is... Do, so, then you mean you, you have questions. Significa que tienen preguntas, right? Just go ahead. Ask me. Digan, ¿qué quieren que les reexplique o qué, qué preguntas tienen? All right? Go ahead. If not, I will ask you. Si no me pregunta y me estás diciendo que tenemos de entendiste un seis, yo te voy a preguntar a vos. So tell me. Uh, uh, three questions. I don't understand very much. Tell, tell me. Yeah. That's not a question. What, what is it that you don't understand? ¿Qué es lo que no entendes? What's the boy name? No, no, no. David has got. Ah, okay. Ah, una, una de las preguntas. Yes. You're talking about one of the questions. Yes. Debbie has yes. got a car. Yeah. A cat. Okay. Uh, que, que que te what do you want God, to explain to you? God. God. Okay, guys. Has got. Esto, guys. Esto aquí. Esto es lo mismo que vos digas. Has. Oh. Or have. Okay. Significa lo mismo. Has got. Got it? Has got. Okay. Has, has got. No. To, de, to, de, no. De to, todo o de tener. De, de tener, guys. Tiene. Okay. Yeah, de tener, right? Mm -hmm. es, es, eso es lo mismo que vos digas has or have, okay? Yeah. So has got, o sea, las dos palabras significan has or have. So this is the yeah. same as saying Debbie, you know, Debbie Teacher. has a cat. Significa lo mismo, got it? Yes, Miguel? Uh -huh. yo, no, yo he oído que dicen has got es cuando dicen eh, no Spanish. No Spanish, yes. Guys, the, the word got, okay, the word get is el presente, right? It has a lot of meanings, okay? All right? But when you have has got, guys, no hay, guys, solo recuerden, has got significa have, okay? Got it? Why, why is God? But why what? Why is God? Why? And that's the way, why, that's, that's the meaning of the word. That, that is the meaning of the word, uh -huh. okay? All right, people say like this, Debbie, Debbie's got, see, Debbie's got a cat. I can say, I've, I can say, I've got a, I, I've got a car. Tengo un carro. I have got a car. And so I've got a car is contraído, right? But it's the same, I have got a car. 
right? It's the same as saying I have a car. Sí. Vos me estás preguntando por qué got, ¿ok? Eso significa have got. Las dos palabras significan tener. Eso es el significado. That's what it is. All right. Is verbo. It's, it's is it a verb? Yes, it is a verb. Yes, get. Yes. Mm, okay. Yes. Also. Yeah. Um. Such a man. It's my. All right, let me let me tell you why why it's not so so okay because okay. I got a car guys is the same as saying I have a car you can also say I've got a car y también significa I have a car okay esto guys have got significa has I mean have or or ha, uh, has okay got it eso es todo lo que tenés que recordar have got significa have or has okay Okay. All right. So, um, so that's it. All right. Very good. Did that answer your question? Respondí, respondió a tu pregunta eso? Yes. No? Thank right. you. All right. Any other question, guys? Me, 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 Fernando. Tell me, tell me, tell me. Yes. Uh, I confuse who is the possession and what is a who talk, talk, uh, who is talk or, or who is possession, I don't know. Yeah, I, I understand, I, I understand, I understand. Uh -huh. you, you, wanted, you wanted to know which is the, the owner and which is the possession, right? Uh-huh. You want to know which is the owner and which is the possession, right? You got it. All okay. right, very good, okay. But in, in sentences, simple is very, Easy, yeah. By uh, example, thanks. what's the boy's name? Is the names of the boy? Yes, but it depends it... on the context. Depends del contexto. Tienes que entender el contexto. Uh -huh. So, for example, what's the boy's name? Si yo te pregunto cuál es el nombre del, del, del chico, what am I asking? I'm asking about his name is no. Uh huh. Exactly. Estoy preguntando del nombre, right? Entonces. La pregunta, o sea, el contexto tienes que entenderlo y vos sabes, ah, me, es, dice, name is Ben Scott. Ah, oh, entonces voy a hablar del name, ok? Oh, uh -huh. his name, got it? But, ok, and the number four, uh -huh. the dog is very cute. Uh -huh. uh, this is uh, some confused for me. Sure, sure, tell me. Ok, fine. Uh, What is the answer? For, First of all, what, a, is, what is the answer? Animal. Uh -huh. Animal is its, its name. Yes. For me, it's. Yes, sí, but, esa es la respuesta. Uh -huh. but, its name is Ben. No. That's the answer. You say her? No. I, I didn't say her, guys. No, Maybe I, his. I, I, I think it, I. I all right with right, let, let me explain but, something to you guys with animals I mentioned this yesterday con los animales guys okay vos puedes decir it's vos puedes decir his vos puedes decir her why ah. his and her guys lo puedes usar cuando vos le das un género a tu perro o a tu perra got it si vos querés llamarlo de his or her got it Okay. Pero no es necesario, right? Pero si vos ves una vaca, no vas a decir su nombre porque vos no conoces a la vaca, right? You don't have mm -hmm. a pet. You know, you know, you, you don't have a, a, a cow's pet, right? No es tu mascota, vos no sabes <laughs> ni siquiera la diferencia entre todo, yo no sé, guys, la diferencia entre un toro uh -huh. y una vaca, right? So, so I say it's because I don't know the gender, okay? Got it? So, uh, all right, so that's that's the reason why, guys, okay? Very okay. good. Um, did that answer your question? Yes. Thank you. All right. Great. Any other question, guys? Other pregunta? No. Can we move on? Okay. Awesome. Okay, guys. So. So, anyways, okay. All right. Now, today, guys, we're going to talk about questions with the verb be. Okay. Everybody, bring out your bring out your notebooks. Okay. Todo el mundo saque sus cuadernos. All right. <laughs> So uh, let's take a look at the first example here. Let's see, Stephanie. All right, Stephanie, could you please help me read, Stephanie? 
podrías ayudar a leer, por favor. Yes. And what's your name? Where's your friend? Hold on. And what's your name? Who's, what's your name? My name is my name's Beth. Yes. Uh -huh. Where's your friend? He is in class. Uh -huh. Who's on he? She is my classmate. Beautiful. Beautiful, Stephanie. Okay. All right. So notice, guys, notice, first of all, uh, notice that we are asking questions with a WH word. What is a WH word, guys? ¿Quién me puede decir que es una WH word? Un ejemplo, ejemplos. Examples. Give me examples. Yes? Anybody? Solo pregunta. Where, who? All right. What? Where, who, yes, una pregunta, a question, right? Okay, so a word, a, a WH word, you know, starts with, uh, es una palabra que empieza con WH, guys, got it? All right, so that is the WH question, okay? Now, what we're going to learn is a WH question, guys, followed by the verb B. Una WH question que le sigue la, el, el, el verbo cero estar, verb B, got it? Yes? All right, guys, so notice that we are using contractions, guys. You got it? See, mm -hmm. we're using contractions here. We're using a contraction here. We're using a contraction here, right? Es una contracción, guys, del verb be. Got it? All right. So, uh, so notice, guys, if I ask you a WH word, guys, are you going to answer with yes or no? Si yo te pregunto una palabra con un, un WH word, ¿me vas a responder con sí o no? ¿O me vas a dar una respuesta completa? Are you going to give me a full answer? Are you going to give me an open uh an open-ended answer short question short answer me vas a dar una very good okay me vas a dar una, una complete answer right? una open-ended answer got it you're gonna give me an open-ended answer all right so that is the difference guys okay entonces podemos decir guys que utilizamos el doble wh questions para dar open-ended answers what do we use for guys para que lo usamos to give what Open-ended open answers, answer. okay? Very good. All right, uh, uh, let's see. Evelyn, help me read the second example, the second uh, group of examples. Okay. Um, what are your classmates like? They are very nice. Where are your and Luisa from? We are from Brazil. How old, how old are how are your classes? They are really interesting. Very good. Okay, right. Very good. Good job. Thank you. Thank you. All right. So see, guys, we're providing more information. Estamos proveyendo más información, right? So let's start with who, guys. Okay. So first of all, WH questions with B. Okay. Uh, who wants to help me read, guys? Can we get it out Anybody? Jose, let's go, Jose. Let's go. Jose, you're muted. Está muteado. Ajá. Doblez, doblez, es question with me. Doubles question ask for specific information about some, something or someone. They cannot be answered with yes or no. All right. So, they guys, no. uh -huh. all right. Thank, thank you for so Thank you. Okay. So, guys, who, all right, double uh, question, guys, we use them to talk about something or someone. Okay. We do not answer with yes or no. Okay. Esa es la diferencia entre un yes or no question. No puede responder con un sí ni un no. Got it? All right. Very good. Okay. All right. Okay. So, uh, so we're going to talk about, you know, um, about the verb be here. So the first WH question that we have, guys, the first WH word that we have right down in your notebook, right? Is, is what, guys? Who. Who, okay. And what do we use who for? Para que usamos who? To talk about people, okay? For example, okay? Una, um, 
let's see, um, Laura, all right? Let's read the question. Who in the kitchen? Laura, let's read the question, please. I think your microphone is not working. Creo que tu micrófono no está funcionando. All right. Uh, me, Stephanie, right, Stephanie? Let me read. Who is in the kitchen? Very good, okay, very good. Guys, can you see, guys, can you see where is the WH word? Donde está la WH word here? Here, right? Where is the verb be here, guys? Donde está el verb be here? Is. Is. Is, okay, who is in the kitchen, okay? All right, so this is the search. Who is in the, in the kitchen? Now, take a look at how you answer. Vean como responden, guys. No, no van a responder con un sí o con un no, right? Están respondiendo, guys, right? Con información completa. Nicholas is in the kitchen. Repeat, guys. Nicholas is in the kitchen. Nicholas is in the kitchen. Is in the kitchen. All right, okay, very good. So now, guys, your turn, okay? Ustedes pregunten ahora, okay? Laura, uh, well, is your microphone working, Laura? Está funcionando tu, tu micrófono. Hello. Now, can you hear me? Yes, yes, Laura, yes. Laura, preguntame, haceme una pregunta con who, okay? Ask me. Preguntame algo a mí. Who is your best friend? All right, okay. Who is my who is my best friend? Okay. I will answer to you. My best friend is Rafa. Okay, that's that's his name. Okay, good job. All right, Jose, ask me another question, Jose. Now, uh, now, uh, Stephanie, you are going to answer. So, Jose, uh, let's ask a question. I actually ask me a question about Stephanie. Preguntame a mí una cosa acerca de Stephanie. Con who? No. All right. Mm. So, sigue el ejemplo, sigue el ejemplo. Ajá. Uh -huh. El ejemplo de que está aquí, ¿verdad? Right? Sigue ese ejemplo. Ask me. Who okay. is uh, huh? who is uh, in the garden, in the Stephanie's garden? Very no. good, okay, very good. Okay, I like that, okay. All right, I like that. I think, okay, good job, man. Who, who is in Stephanie's garden? Garden, okay. ¿Quién está en el, en el, en el jardín de Stephanie, right? Stephanie, who is in your garden? In my garden, I'm my brothers. Okay, now, you don't say my garden and my brothers, you say, primero sujeto, quien es sujeto de la oración? Who, who is the, the subject of the sentence? My brothers. Okay, continua, termina su oración. My brothers are in the garden. Very good, my brothers are in the garden. Okay, good job, good job, Stephanie. All right, Miguel, ask ask a question to Stephanie about Evelyn. Mm. Stephanie acerca de Evelyn. Who is Stephanie House? No, 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 no. Who is no, Stephanie? No, no. no. Preguntale, I don't know. Preguntale, uh, I don't know, something about someone. Remember that you have to ask about someone, right? Es una persona de quien tenés que preguntar. The, the, the structure was good. La estructura va bien en la estructura, Miguel. All right? Solo cambia. No digas casa. Don't, don't say house. Okay. Who is... Uh, the king? Stephanie? Who is... Uh, who is... Uh, ya se me olvidó que, que le ibas a preguntar. <laughs> <laughs> Evelyn. A Evelyn. I, I, okay, right, yes. A Evelyn sobre Stephanie le vas a preguntar. O creo que este, uh, Sí, así era, ¿verdad? A Evelyn sobre Stephanie, yes. Yes. I think. Who is Stephanie Near? Who is Stephanie's what? Near. Nears. What, what's Nears? Cerca. No, 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 no. no, no. You can't say no, no. I lose. Okay. Who is Stephanie's? Dame un noun. Dame, dame un, un sustantivo aquí. Un sustantivo. You can say, who is Stephanie with? Con quien está Stephanie, right? Who is Stephanie with? O puede decir, who is Stephanie's 
uh, father, que okay? cuando le pones esto, eso aquí es una posición, right? Who's Stephanie's father? ¿Quién es el papá de Stephanie? Okay. Right? So, who's Stephanie's father? Okay? ¿Quién es el papá de Stephanie? Evelyn, who's Stephanie's father? I mean, uh, father. Daniel is father. Uh, Daniel is Stephanie's. Uh, Daniel is Stephanie's father. Father. Good job. Okay. Good job. All right. Uh, Nancy. All right. Now, guys, the questions that you're asking, okay, are very complicated. Okay. Follow the. Uh, Se están confundiendo, guys, porque están haciendo unas preguntas más complejas. Sigan esta estructura, okay? All right, let's let's start simple. Nancy, ask uh, ask uh, Catherine a question. Preguntale a Catherine una pregunta. Okay. Who is Catherine at war? No, 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 no. Hace, hace, sigan, guys, sigan esa estructura, okay? Preguntale, Catherine, who, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Uh, Catherine, who is uh, who is uh, Seguir la estructura. Eso dice, uh, ¿quién está en la cocina? Preguntar otra cosa. ¿Quién? Is possible wash. Who is, yes. Who is washing the dishes, for example? No. ¿Quién está lavando los trastes? Right? But no, guys, sigan esa estructura. Okay, les voy a dar la estructura aquí, guys, okay? Who plus verb B plus complement, okay? Okay, uh, vamos a poner who is, aquí uh, the compliment guys could be, um, the compliment could be a noun, right? Puedes poner un noun aquí, lo voy a poner en paréntesis para decir que, para denotar que es opcional. Puedes poner un noun, who is him, puedes poner who is uh, in, for, for example, right? Puedes poner in plus a noun, right? Esas dos cosas, right? So, entonces, me puedes decir, who is him? Who is Cheyenne? Who is Shakira? Got it? All right. Or you can say, who is in the garage? Who is in your bedroom? See? All right, very good. So, Nancy, all right, Nancy, let's write again, right? Oh, Jose, Jose, creo que usted levantó la mano. All right, let's go, Jose. Yes. Uh, example. Who are uh, singing louder? Who are singing louder. louder? Very good. Good job. Louder. ¿Quiénes están cantando más, más alto? Good job. Good job, man. ¿Sí? ¿Por qué está usando R aquí? Es porque se está refiriendo a, a mucha gente. A plural. Got it? Right? But it's the verb be. Okay. Very good. Um, Catherine, give me another example, Catherine. Who, who is in the living room? Who is in the, very good, who is in the dining room? Oh, okay. So who is in the, okay, dining room. Very good, okay. All right, very good. All right, this is good. Uh, Evelyn, give me another, uh, give me another question. Okay. Who is in the park? Who is in the park, okay? Good job, who is in the park, okay? Good job, guys, do, I'll do me a favor, antes de que nos vayamos, guys, todos envíenme dos ejemplos, guys, con who. Envíenme una con who, uh, y esta parte de la estructura. Esto, right? Y envíenme otra con who, y esta otra parte de la estructura, okay? So, me pueden decir, who is Cheyenne, o who are your brothers, for example, right? For example, who are your brothers, sería so el noun, right? Your brothers, okay? O me pueden decir, all right, uh, who is in, I don't know, your bathroom, for example, got it? Or who is in his bathroom, right? Very good, so follow this structure, guys, all right? Todo el mundo, mírenme dos ejemplos, guys, let's go. All right, who is in the bathroom? Oh, Stephanie. <laughs> That was my example. Who is your boss? Very good. Okay, can you have him? All right, you are my boss. 
uh, Evelyn, who is dancing, very good, right? Who is dancing? I am not, that's for sure. How? No. Who? Not how. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Yes. Is... Who are fixing the car? Who? Yes. All right, who? Very good. So who is Clarissa, they said. Who are the classmates? Acuérdate que si usted are, te está refiriendo en plural, right? So it shouldn't be classmates, it should be classmates. So many classmates, not one, not many, okay? Now, uh, ahí, Jose, Miguel. <laughs> ah, yeah. ah, okay. Okay. Okay, or who is fixing the car, right? Very good. Laura, who is painting in the room? Who is in the roof? Good job. Good job, good job, good job. Right? Who is Michael? Who is Brad Pitt? Okay, good job, guys. Good job. All right. Pretty good, guys. All right. High five to you. All right. Guys, um, so tomorrow, guys, thank you, guys. Your examples are perfect. Todos los ejemplos, guys, están perfectos. Uh, mañana, guys, eh, traten de completar la, la sección 1 y 2. Mañana yo les ayudo con las respuestas, right? So tomorrow, um, try to complete section 1 and 2, and I'll, I'll help you out with, uh, with those two sections tomorrow, okay? Yes? Okay. All right. Hey. All right. No. Very good. Uh, any question, guys? Alguna pregunta? Are you sleepy? Are you sleepy? Yes. Are you tired? Yes. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Mañana, mañana vamos a practicar, guys. Mañana vamos a practicar más. Eh, vamos a terminar lo de Dolish Words. Y después vamos a, a comenzar la sección 2. Eh, aquí, ¿verdad? La semana que viene. Y vamos a comenzar lo del metro. Ok. Ustedes, guys, sí, okay. traten de terminar la 1, la 2, y, uh, y yo mañana les ayudo con las respuestas, ¿got it? Pero necesito que hagan ustedes primero de esas dos secciones y yo les ayudo mañana aquí, ¿ok? ¿Sounds good? All right. Be early, guys, por favor, conéctense temprano. Acuérdense que no somos demasiados, así que... Hey, little kid. <laughs> All right, so we're not too many, guys. Uh, guys, soy malísimo hablando con los niños. No sé qué decirles nunca. <laughs> <laughs> Hola, criatura, I right? like no. <laughs> All right, nice, Bye. nice kid, Laura. Um, so anyways, guys, thanks a lot. I'll see you tomorrow, guys. Have a good night. Now, ahora sí pueden decir good night. See? Good night. Good see you guys. night. Good night. See you guys. Good night. Good night. Good night.